So what is up, Kate P? What? Gang, 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 gang. I'm at work. Mm. I'm always the first person here, so. Yeah, I just thought I'd do a little introduction for you guys. <laughs> Enjoy the intro. So hi guys, welcome back to my channel. 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 My name is Kendra and you're watching KP Camp. vlog a little bit last night because I did take my hair out or whatever but you know how it comes on first day hair so that is just on that so let me show y'all what I was looking like okay this is what I was looking like and I still feel like I'm I'm right there but that's okay it's okay we about to progress in life you know it's Friday it's payday ah! The weeks go by so fast, like, I swear I just looked up and it was Friday. Thank the Lord Jesus. I just want y'all to know that I work three jobs, okay? Three. Alright y'all, so I basically just left work or whatever and I was just in the FedEx and y'all. So basically I had to ship out packages from my other job and they want us to get a receipt. I could have just dropped my package off in like a little drop off mailbox thing. But they want a receipt for it, which come on now, you don't need no receipt. Nevertheless, I delivered the packages. So that should be an eight dollar bonus. Right there. But I'm about to go to go see my lash tech. <laughs> she does do lashes at her place, so I'm not gonna show y'all where it's at, but I may try to record when I get in there if she allows me. But I just cannot wait and y'all I be so tired after work and I'm really about to be knocked out, okay? Like knocked out cold. If it's up, then it's up, then it's up, then it's up. If it's up, then it's up, then it's up, then it's up. Hey! If it's up, then it's up. If it's up, then it's up, then it's up, then it's up. Okay, y'all, I'm here. Y'all meet my last tag. Hey. <laughs> y'all, I've been missing this, like in the aesthetic. It's just so great. Ooh, so cute. But y'all, I don't know how people be holding the camera the whole time. That would not be me. You gonna blink it? Uh, yes, sure. Let's get cozy. Okay, now a little blanket. Yes. Okay, period. Well, you haven't been here. Look. Yes. Let's get together. <laughs> okay, y'all, this is my before. Looking crusty. I'll show y'all my after when I'm done. So good morning everyone. If you know me, I do not talk in the morning. But it is about 10.38, a little bit behind schedule. But I'm gonna go ahead and go to the gym, okay? My brother usually come with me, but he's a flaker. He's a consistent flaker. I don't know if this is considered, you know, transformation or whatever but i usually wear my little sweatband or whatever i wish you can go to the gym one time and then that's it and you snatched already but you know i feel like this is contributing to my transformation oh let me check out my lashes you don't see them let me try to get the camera Gotta get that side angle so y'all can see. But yeah, they look really good. Um, 
Sorry I just left the vlog last night, y'all. I was running on fumes, okay? And like I said, I didn't get to eat. <sighs> Jesus. But I think I'm on film. I really think I'm on film today, y'all. Like, a real video. Because I haven't done it in so long. And I feel like it's overdue. I know y'all love vlogs, but... But I'm leaving the gym right now. I'm leaving the gym right now. Today I tried to target like my butt and my legs. Um, I usually just do a little bit of cardio, like a little bit, because I don't like running or nothing like that. Usually y'all, I do not work out my thighs like at all because I've always had nice thighs just from dancing because obviously I'm not dancing correctly and I use my quads a lot. But y'all, I actually did the thigh machine. <laughs> oh, Lord Jesus. That thing was a killer, a killer. But I realized um, I can't just keep my thigh, like as much as I am cool with my thigh size, I cannot keep it the same and expect like a huge difference with my butt. Like, you know, like my thighs, appeared smaller then my butt would appear bigger you know you get my logistics so that's why i actually did the dye machine today like, i usually try to get in and out in an hour because if i start working out past an hour y'all i will do every machine up in there and just try to push 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 but like doing everything in one day is not gonna get you like a whole bunch of results so what am i talking about results like i'm a trainer ha <laughs> no honey I just do what I think is right, you know? I don't, but I, I'm not necessarily like trying to lose a whole bunch of weight, but I literally just want my clothes to fit better. Like that's literally just where I'm at right now. Two hours later. Okay, so let me just go ahead and show y'all how I am getting ready. Usually on the weekends, I go in a little harder because, you know, I have extra time to actually focus on things. But first off, I am, Brushing my teeth with this new Crest 3D Whites. I'm going to see if it's giving teeth whitening. I'm going to try to do like, probably going to try to test it for like a month or so to see if I get some different results. See if I get some different results. But after that, I just go in and clean my lashes. I'm trying to do better with this and making sure that I clean them, clean them so that I can have better retention. That's what they say, you know, clean lashes, keep them on or whatever. And I just have this like lash soap that I got from a previous lash tech that I had. And yeah, that's just how I do it. From there, I just go ahead and wash my face. Um, I just wash my face with some generic soap or whatever. And I just started using, wow, it's just a new thing this year. But I started using this facial face washer, whatever you call it, exfoliator. It has like little itty bitty bristles. And they're super duper soft, y'all. I would never think the texture was like it is. But basically, it's supposed to help exfoliate the skin. So I use this after I apply my soap. And as y'all can see, the dirt, it picks up the dirt. And I basically just do keep on washing up until it starts to look clear on the facial washer. This is actually something that I usually do. I just go in with a tweezer, and this might be ghetto, but I just go in with a tweezer and just pick my face. So, you know, if I have any pimples, if I have pimples that you have, they scar up and they scab up. So I just go ahead and pick the scabs, and I also get like dry skin sometimes, or like my skin will flake up. So I just go ahead and pick those off as well. I know that sounds weird, but that is just the details, honey. Get into the details. 
I just go in with my cream that my dermatologist recommended and then I just have like an oil that I combine with it. As well as apply this moisturizer that's for oily skin and it also has SPF so that's really why I use it because it has sunscreen in it. And then y'all like I said I'm doing a little extra and I usually don't shave as much during the cold times because of course who's really seeing it but you know you don't want to be giving wolf so I just went ahead and shaved my armpits and I just used this razor as if it was like a man shaving a beard in his sink I just go ahead and put my arm over the sink and I just let the hair fall in the sink and yeah that's me I would do a little grooming in other places but I think I'm good I think I'm okay for now so yeah Let's start. Okay, this might be TMI, but you know it is what it is. And I could let it go down and drain, y'all, but that is not good in the long run. For your drain. Good day. <clears throat> I wanted to mention that I want to start taking um, vitamin D supplements. Um, I was watching this video yesterday. And the girl was saying, well, she has like some other conditions going on, but she was saying that she may have had a vitamin D deficiency, which basically can result in a lack of energy. And that may have had something to do with her depression, which to me was like, maybe there was like an underlying cause of like how I was feeling like before or whatever. I've been to the doctor before and they've said that um, my iron was really low and that they recommend me um, taking vitamin D supplements. And I've always bought them like, y'all, I'm finna show y'all. Like, I bought vitamin D like, thinking that I didn't have it, but really I did the entire time. I've never really taken them consistently. Um, maybe I've done it for like a week straight. But I've never like continuously did it like I need to. So, I don't know if today is making a difference. I know I did go to the gym. But I really have not felt tired. And usually when I come from the gym, or anytime I just get in my bed, period, I just feel the need that I need to go to sleep. But I actually didn't feel like that today. So maybe we're making some progression. Okay, y'all. So I'm about to head up, head out really, really fast because I set my nail appointment to like 3.30. But I need to go ahead and take my hair out. So I had twisting before. And I had them in all week. And I just took them out yesterday. So... What I do at night is I usually just try to put it like, put my hair in a ponytail or like two ponytails or something. Just so it doesn't get too flat. And it's kind of stretching out the roots a little bit. I am trying to grow my hair out because though it's grown like significantly, I want to really get some more hair growth or length. So... I'm not necessarily trying a method, but there's this YouTuber that I follow and she grew her hair out from a big shop. And basically she was just saying how she had very low ma manipulation to her hair. I mean, she wore wigs, which I can get on the wig wave, but I just don't think wigs are for me. So she wore wigs a lot and she was saying how she was didn't wash her hair like that. And yeah so i took some parts of that video and i'm washing my hair a lot less like a lot less like she was saying she went months without washing her hair i don't know if i go months but i'll definitely go probably a month or so like i probably wash my hair only once a month now also y'all my edges fell out i know people probably not gonna notice because i don't wear my hair slick back or anything but yeah my edges are trash i feel like my hairline looks disgusting so i'm trying to grow out my edges as well and if you don't know i do have a lock in the back of my head that i'll show y'all and i think we're ready to go I'm supposed to put my hoodie on first before 
before I did my hair. And y'all, it's kind of warm today. I don't really like the fit. I don't really like this. Who I could try to tie it up? Oh, it don't look bad already. All right, because I got to go. Just the fit. Real basic to know with the drip. All right, let me head out. All right, y'all, I'm here. I gotta go because my appointment's at 3 30 and it's 3 31. And some girl just walked in. I don't want her to take my spot. But yeah, my nails look a mess. As you can see. It's a recording, yeah. As you can see, they look a hot mess. And I literally need to cut them down this time because some stuff I'm just not able to do no more. I couldn't even get my car out of the gas jump. <laughs> Um, I had an appointment. I need to get dip powder. Okay. Okay, y'all. So this is my set. Can y'all see? This is my set. Pretty in pink. Um, it's real disrespectful how I made my appointment. I made my appointment and then I got up in there and was still waiting. I hate when they do that. I hate waiting because I've been up in there too long and look, it's getting dark. Two hours later. Let me it's show not giving. Let me show my house. It's not giving. I might take pictures out here. Oh, I take pictures in front of city trees. Less traffic. <laughs> I think I'm gonna get this one. But then again, should I just spend a band on the bag? We're going on a trip soon. To where? Hmm? Where are we going? I'm going to Atlanta. For real? Desperate need. Of a wallet, and this is the best they got. Mm -hmm. Try to make it look. It's trash. Oh, I think I'm just gonna get this one. But this bag? This bag? It's calling my name. We are live. All right, so I couldn't find my white sweatpants that I need for my Valentine's Day look, but I'm gonna try to look at Walmart. Uh -huh. I'm actually getting hungry again, so we're gonna have to wrap this up soon. Uh -huh. But um, I wanted a duffel bag, a duffel bag for traveling, okay? <laughs> Always going like, on a weekend, overnight, a little jump jump. I'm gonna get this one, because okay. I don't own a black purse anymore. I used to have a huge one, but I wore it until I couldn't wear it no more. So I'm gonna get this one. But, in the wallet, of course. The Juicy Couture bag is giving looks. Or I can get the Steve Madden bag. Which matches with my Steve Madden purse. Are you seeing it? I'm, I'm getting it. And then it got like the side pocket. Alright, let's get the Steve side Madden. Pocket. Let's get the Steve Madden. And I see another compartment. So. Okay. The mm -hmm. Steve Madden is given. They have some other ones, but they was given very much diaper bag. And I don't want to look like I, I have a child, so. I don't think it was wrong with the diaper bag. It was a nice, it was a nice diaper bag. The diaper bag was pretty for that. It was nice. But I want the duffel bag shape. It's really not giving the shape I want, like the Juice Couture. But if you think about logistics. Did somebody put in the comments what Juicy Couture is? It's a brand. Bro, what? That's type like, of print. That's like somebody asking you what's Nike. What is Nike? My Madden on Madden. Come on, Steve. Sponsor me, Steve. Cut the cameras. All right, y'all. I'm in my, I'm in my, you know, creative bag, and I forgot to record. And I couldn't ask Mouse to record because he was taking my pictures. But y'all, I'm literally in front of the City Trans. Can y'all see City Trans in the back? 
Yeah, you see that black history sign? Uh-huh. Come on, city trends. But yeah, I'm literally in like the storefront. You know they having like the little you know the little lights. And I just went on my Hoochie app. And let me just show y'all some of the bangers. Can y'all see that? Yeah. I mean, is it giving or is it giving? Yeah. Remember, go follow me at, um... Chapos? What's her name? Oh, yeah, Rock, Rock XMP. Wow. Y'all yeah. yeah, looked, and I looked, and I looked again. I'm just confused. Like, and on TikTok, I, they said that, they said they had the graphic tees for filming. Walmart don't got nothing. I mean, they have some Nirvana shirts. <laughs> but y'all, I want Mouse to give me this. I'm not about to buy that there. This is my new baby Arthur. Um, Are you about to buy that? No, bro. It's only $20, though. So if y'all looking for Valentine's stuffed animals, Walmart got them on the other side of town. Um, fully stocked. To... Fully stocked. These are only $20. What you trying to say? I don't know. I haven't been to the other Walmarts. But I'm going to be honest. It probably ain't in stock. Get you one for your significant other. <laughs> or or your friend. <laughs> your family. <laughs> Miles, what you getting me? This? Chipotle. You getting me Chipotle for real? Yeah. Good morning. I was not going to vlog at first, but I just felt like, you know, I was doing something. So let me get on camera. I'm just cooking some bacon for breakfast. Y'all don't usually cook. But when there's somebody here and they get very much living on my own, I do what I gotta do. So I'm just watching YouTube and I'm thinking I'm gonna make a smoothie. That's really why I came on camera because I thought that would be interesting. And I'm just gonna um, eat some muffins with that. That's already made, my dad already made some, so. And y'all, please go. Y'all, I have never used this before in my life. As long as we had it, I've never used it. Basically, I have some blackberries. I think I'm just gonna put these on the top because I don't know if these are gonna blend well. I don't know. But I could eat this whole thing, but I'm trying not to because Sharon is caring. So I have these frozen fruits. Y'all have never done this. This has dark sweet cherries, blackberries, strawberries, and blueberries. So, there's honestly not that many strawberries. So, I may just be able to pick it out of the blender. Or should I just risk my life? I won't die. No, I'm not going to put that much out because I honestly don't like a whole bunch of smoothie, you know? And I don't want it to be too watery. Oh my gosh, I hate watery smoothies. Like, what is that? I'm just gonna go ahead and put a banana in here. Yeah, I hate watery smoothies. Like, the audacity. Y'all, we actually have a juicer that we have not used in years. Man, I'm always the queen of buying kitchen supplies. And y'all, it's gonna on the next. I'm gonna put a little apple juice. I don't know how this finna taste. Oh my gosh, I'm really over here winging it. Y'all don't judge me. I really, that's what I need to get. So, I told y'all I wanted to start making, taking vitamin D uh, supplements. And I think I want to start buying pre-workout um, before I go to the gym or some type of protein powder or something. Let me see if we got some. I don't think we have, I don't think we have anything like that. I'm not gonna lie, not to say that this is not a healthy household, but. Some of that extra stuff, <laughs> we just don't do over here. And I always just think about y'all. I just really feel like I would eat better if I lived alone because I would be buying my own groceries and I wouldn't have to worry about other people caring or wanting what I have. Did that make sense? Should I add this? Ah, it might mess it up. I'm gonna add a dash. If it don't taste good, 
I'm definitely gonna add some more apple juice or something. Oh my gosh! Somebody help me. I'm a y'all like girl. I just what are we Let's see. Wait a minute. It got a little bit of Strain it. Let's see, got your blackberry seeds. It's actually giving me stickums. No, it's whatever, but it's the pulp for me. It's a whole piece of ice in here. Ooh, ooh, child, she's too thick. She is way too thick. Yes, this is a good amount, y'all, because I did do not like a whole bunch. I know plastic straws are trash, but here we are. Let's see. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What a side to see. Mm. Mm-hmm. Okay, y'all, so my camera is about to die, so I'm just gonna go ahead and end the vlog right here. Hope y'all enjoy. Okay, my camera is really giving up on me, but I hope y'all enjoyed me trying to get my life together. Comment, like, and subscribe on this video. Comment down below.